1885, Rock Springs, Wyoming. in a memorial presented to the Chinese consul in New York. The Chinese miners in Rock Springs, Wyoming, described the massacre. 1885. The dead body of Liu Sun Tung, found in his own hut in the native settlement, was covered with many wounds. The left jawbone was broken, evidently by a bullet. The skin and bone of the right leg below the knee were injured. I also ascertained that the deceased was 51 years old and had a mother, wife, and son living at home in China. The dead body of Liu Kao Bu was found between mines number three and four at the foot of the mountain. The neck was shot through crosswise by a bullet, cutting the windpipe in two. I also ascertained that the deceased was 24 years old. His family connections have not yet been clearly made known. The dead body of Yi Si Yen was found near the creek. The left temple was shot by a bullet, and the skull broken. The age of the deceased was 36 years. He had a mother living at home in China. Five bodies were found more or less mutilated. The portion of the dead body 
a portion of the dead body of the Ulang, a portion of the dead body of the Ulang adjoining camp found in pile of ashes in a hut It consisted of the head, neck, together with the rest of the body. Head, two hands together with rest of body below the waist. Two hands together with rest of body below the waist. A portion of the dead body of Liu Chi Ming was found in a pile of ashes. I also ascertained that the deceased was 45 years old. The remains of Yang Tsung Bong and Su A Chiang were found. It consisted of the head and chest. The hands, together with the rest of the body below the waist, were burned off completely. I also ascertained that deceased was 49 years old and had a mother, wife, and son living at home. A portion of the dead body of Liu Chi Ming was found in a pile of ashes in the hut of the deceased near the temple where the remains of Liang Tsun Bong and Su A Chiang were found. It consisted of the head and chest. The hands, together with the rest of the body below the waist, were burned off completely. I also ascertained that deceased was 49 years old and had a mother, wife, and son living at home. Also, another son who lived in the cold mines. Near the temple where the deceased, together with Liu Chi Ming and Xu A Chiang, had lived. It consisted of the head, shoulders, and hands. The sole and heel of the left foot. The rest of the body below the chest was burned off completely. The age of the deceased was 42 years. He had a wife and two sons living at home. All living at home. A portion of the dead body of Liu Tzu Wing was found in a pile of ashes in the hut adjoining camp number 14. It consisted of the bones of the lower half of the body, extending from hip to foot. The rest of the body was burned off completely. I also ascertained that the deceased was 39 years old. His family connection has not yet been clearly made known. Liu Ju Fu. A portion of the dead body of Su A Chong was found in a pile of ashes in the hut near the temple where the deceased Yi, together with Liu Chiming and Liang Sun Bong had lived. Liu Long it consisted of the skull bone, Yip A Marn, the upper and lower jaw bones, and teeth. A portion of the dead body of Luo Han Lung was found in the hut adjoining to 34. Liang Ding. The remains of Chu Bao Huai Yat. Yu Wen Chen. consisted of the soul and heel of the body of Tang. The rest Chun of the body was burned. I also ascertained that the deceased the was 32 years old and had parents, wife, and son and living at home. Turned into it consisted of the right half of a head and the backbone. A portion the of the, the dead body of Liu Tzu Wing was found in a pile of ashes in the hut adjoining camp number 14. It consisted of the bones of the lower half of the body, extending from hip to foot. The rest of the body was burned off. Twelve completely. fragments of bones belonging to twelve of the above named persons were found in twelve different places in the Chinese settlement. No trace of the remaining three persons was found. No one was ever prosecuted for the murders.